Hey guys, how's it going? Hope you guys are doing well. For me, I am having a pretty good day so far. I've actually been really busy all morning. Um, just getting paperwork done, same old, same old, and I actually did a lot of cleaning. So every room is pretty much clean, which is, you know, always a good feeling. So I'm happy about that. Um, so you guys can see that I'm rocking the little side ponytail today. Cute. I like it. I just finished up with everything I wanted to do around the house and I am going to go to the gym and then I have to stop by the grocery store. I don't know if it's just me or a lot of people find themselves going to the grocery store like every other day. That is totally me. But um, I just need to get a few things. So Tom and I uh, do Blue Apron and so we got a package that came in today. We were doing it for a while but then we slowed down just because uh, the packages were coming quicker than we could really eat them. But we got another package. So um, it just comes like this. This is not a sponsored video at all. I'm just showing you guys what, what we um, got. It gives you like a menu card of what's in your box and um, how to make it, like what are all the ingredients that it comes with and how to make it. Um, I'm not really sure what this is. Extra helpings, I guess. I don't know what that is. And then everything comes like in this package. It's like always really nicely packaged and everything that you're gonna need is in here. And of course there's ice packs and stuff in the bottom to keep everything nice and fresh and cold. This time we got the sumac, I think that's how you pronounce it, sumac spice barramundi with coconut rice and collard greens. And it just looks like this. It looks really, really good actually. Um, I'm excited to give it a try. And then it just shows down here all the ingredients that you're going to need for this particular recipe. And then on the back, it just shows you step by step how to prepare everything and how to cook it. So yeah, I find that it's... Um, really delicious food but it does take a little bit of time to make it we got the family pack so this serves this makes four servings so we both have one for dinner and then we'll have one for lunch or dinner the next day the other meal that was in it that is in it is the fingerling potatoes and ricotta quiche with romaine and cucumber salad this one also looks really really good with blue apron you can skip meals that you don't think sound good so you can pick two meals or whatever your plan is that whatever your plan allows and there's always like um, a few options to choose from and if you don't like any of the options you can skip the meal for the week so I've been skipping for a while but this um, this this particular week I actually thought both meals looked really good so again what you're gonna need and then how to cook it um, step by step on the back so that is blue apron on to the next um, haul um, or things that I want to show you guys this whole basket are things that I got from um, the Dollar Tree in a couple of shopping trips not just one shopping trip so this is just a wet and wild um, what is this makeup brush this is a um, does it say um, large eyeshadow brush so I thought that was pretty cool to have a wet and wild um, brush at the Dollar Tree and I always uh, need more eyeshadow brushes also went and picked up this elf um, smudge pot it just looks like this the color is let me see if I can tell the color what's the color brownie point and it just looks like this I haven't tried it yet as you can see it's still in the packaging because I was waiting to kind of show you guys but it looks really really pretty I almost feel like it's gonna be like a like a cream metallic shadow so I'm excited to give it a try then I picked these up today they're wet and wild like uh, silky finish lipsticks this one's in the color dark um, dark wine I am so excited to give this one a try it's so pretty it looks nice and vampy but um, and deep I just thought it looked so pretty and you can't beat it for a dollar and then there was also this one this is in the color cherry frost and again just like a beautiful true red color I'm so excited to give this a try I'm actually going to be doing a video um, with um, a get ready with me using all drugstore products so be on the lookout for that I'll probably using be using this as my lip color I'm also out of deodorant so I picked up this uh, solid secret powder fresh it's not my favorite but I figured just for a dollar I will go ahead and get it so yeah 
And then I also picked up this like acrylic like lipstick cosmetic organizer, which is actually pretty perfect since I just picked up two more lip products. And it just looks like this, nothing like super spectacular, but um, I don't have a very huge makeup collection. So this will be good um, for me. And then right here, these little circles are for like uh, makeup brushes or lip liners. So I thought that was like really, really cute. Lastly, I picked up this basket. I needed something, oh wait, here's something else. Oh yeah, I forgot, this is the Keep Calm and Party. I think these are like kind of the Rimmel's version of the like Maybelline Baby Lips. It's just like a balm chapstick. It's a little bit tinted, um, but I also got this from the Dollar Tree. I got two of these, I don't know where the other one went, but yeah, I got two of these and they're just, they, they, they go on pretty sheer because I tried this one. They go on pretty sheer, but I thought for a dollar you can't really beat it. You can't really go wrong with having um, an extra chapstick or lip tint around. So yeah, then I picked up this guy. This is just like a little basket. Of course, if you've been to the Dollar Tree um, and you haven't been living under a rock or anything like that, you know that the Dollar Tree is full of these things and YouTube is also full of like DIYs with these kind of baskets. Um, I needed this basket for my linen closet. Moving on to Sephora, I went the other day and I picked up a few things. I ended up going ahead and picking up this YSL, this YSL Rouge Per Couture um, Glossy Stain in the color five. Just looks like this. I absolutely love YSL packaging. It's just so sleek and classic. And this is just like a, um, your lip but better. A little bit more than like a gloss in a um, tint it's more of a cream a cream gloss but it's just the lightest lightest bit of color it just kind of gives your health your lips sorry this like healthy uh tinted uh sheen it's just so so pretty i really really enjoy it so that's that and then i went ahead also and picked up these Saki Brightening Hydro Gel Eye Mask by Bosha. I did use a pair of these and I really, really liked it. I like that these are the gel masks and they're not like paper sheet masks. To me, I don't know, it just seems like, uh, I don't know, they work better when they are the gel ones. Um, so yeah, I put it on um, for about 40 minutes. I wore mine and actually I could tell a difference. I felt like my eyes just felt really, really moisturized, which is the whole reason I got them. I'm not expecting like miracles, but I do like to keep my under eyes hydrated. Last but not least, I got this Belief, the True Cream Moisturizing Balm. And if you follow me on my Instagram, then you saw that I posted this. And this was like a YouTube made me do it purchase. Um, actually, to be specific. Pacific Platinum D. I shouted her out on there because I saw one of her, um, I don't know if it was one of her favorites. Yeah, it was like her one of her videos that she just recently posted about her like must-haves and this was on there. And this is like a gel cream and it's supposed to um, retain moisture for up to 26 hours. And this stuff, just the texture is so different. Like um, I was using the Kiehl's a glacier moisturizer for a really long time but I wanted to try I wanted to try something new and like um, when she raved about it I figured I wanted to go ahead and give it a try and I actually absolutely love the texture it is definitely very moisturizing a little goes a long way and it's very kind of light the bottle looks like this and you get 50 ml of product and like I said, a little bit goes the longest way. And it wasn't that expensive. It was like $38, which I think is pretty good for how good this product is and um, for and how much you get. Some, some, some moisturizers are way more expensive than this and they don't work half as good. But yeah, if you're interested in um, investing or you're looking for a new uh, moisturizing face cream then I would say give this one a try I have um, like oily skin so this is really good because it's a gel cream it's good for oily skin we're getting through this slowly but surely um, next I went to Bath and Body Works I had a coupon for $10 off a $30 purchase and I think I went oh yeah I stopped here at Bath and Body Works the day that Tom and I went to that outdoor mall um, that we talked about in the a couple of vlogs ago. So I absolutely love wallflowers. I'm not really big on candles just because I've mentioned in other videos that I have a tendency to forget to blow them out. So I'm always afraid that I'm going to start a fire. So for that reason, I always go for like wallflowers or the Glade plugins. So um, I went ahead and picked up some wallflowers. They're of course two for 
or six for twenty-four dollars, and then I got the thirty dollars off and blah blah blah. But this is the Magic in the Air one. Uh, I think if I can remember correctly, I've never had it before. It just smelled very kind of fresh and like kind of um, like a little bit fruity, like fruity fresh type of scent, which I really like when um when it comes to filling up the. Uh, my home I don't like um, anything that's gonna be too floral or too like fragrant or musky that might give me a headache so this is kind of like perfect uh, magic in the air and then I picked up this um, champagne toast this one smells really really good it's like kind of fruity fun but kind of subtle still as well and then this is just another magic in the air another uh, champagne toast and then I also got this Tiki Beach. This one smells really, really good. It's almost like if you're in on a tropical beach somewhere, like if you can imagine how that smells, this is exactly what they've embodied um, from that smell, from that concept, I guess. But I already have one uh, going right now, so um, I did get two of them. And yeah, and I'm really, really enjoying it. And then I also picked up these, uh, this hand soap, bath and body ropes, uh, no, hand soap. Uh, hand lotion bath and body works now has these like hand lotion things this one is in sweet as strawberries and it smells so 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 good guys like i am in love with this um smell um and then you can buy these separate keychains or whatever and um these are good to clip on to like your purse or your keys or things like that so that you always have your lotion when you need it Moving on to Target, I picked up these Ollie um, Undeniable Beauty Vitamin Gummies with Biotin, Vitamin C, E, and Barrage Oil. These are good for like hair, skin, and nails. They're like a strawberry, oh, grapefruit flavor. They're so, so, so good. I absolutely love them. So if you're interested in some vitamins and you like like gummy bears, these are perfect. Also picked up this e.l.f brush i think this is a what is it a complexion brush i'm going to use it for blush so it just looks like this i picked up oh this is also from the dollar tree i put this in the wrong pile this is a, the second little um Rimmel keep calm like lip balm that i got i got two of these and then lastly i picked up this elf um duo brush this is like the anastasia beverly hills uh duo brush with like the liner the eyebrow um precision precision brush at one end and then like the spoolie at the other this one was only three dollars guys and the one that you get from sephora is like 18 dollars. so if you're interested in getting the brush for a fraction of the price then go ahead and pick it up at from elf at elf at like target or whatever Hello. Hey <laughs> I was waiting to see if you were going to say something before me. Yeah. Oh my God, my face matches your shirt. So, hey guys. <laughs> <laughs> right? Yeah. Yeah, orange, close. a little bit. Yeah, a little bit. Yeah. Sorry guys, I totally forgot to pull out the camera and end the, end the vlog. So, I started getting ready for my like pamper routine <laughs> but uh look who, who look who's here hey how are you good how are you doing good how was your day it was it was pretty good got a good run in oh, met yeah. up with a friend oh yeah mm -hmm. how long did you run um two miles wow not good bad job, thanks yeah so i know you guys didn't see I don't know if you guys saw Tom in yesterday's vlog, but um, I wanted him to at least be able to say hello in this one and to say goodnight with me. So, um, yeah, I just wanted to close up the vlog properly. Thank you guys for watching. Um, give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it because it does help my channel. And subscribe for more videos if you haven't subscribed already. And yeah, I think I'm going pretty strong, guys. Um, I've been putting up a, I've been trying to put up a vlog every day. So yeah, hopefully you guys are enjoying this. So if you have any comments or questions, go ahead and put them in the comment section below. And I will do my best to get to them. And until my next video, we will talk to you guys very soon. Anything you want to say? Nope. <laughs> Bye. Good night, guys.